Hi, my name is Rosemary Robinson. I am 19 years old and I'm a sophomore at Arkansas Tech University. And this is my story and why I want to be America's Next Top Model. <laughs> oh. Oh. This is about my hundredth time recording. Am I right, Stormy? Yes. My friend doing homework. She's been listening to me all night. Um, I've been doing this so many times because I'm nervous. And I keep messing up because I just want this to go perfectly. Because I want this so badly. It's so scary to think that someone I've never met is determining whether I will achieve my dream or not just by one video. And I have a whole notebook of stuff that I want to say and I've been saying it on every other video But you won't get to know me unless I talk from my heart. And what my heart is telling me is that I want this so bad. I want to be extraordinary. I want to have this lifestyle that I could get from being on America's Next Top Model. I don't want an ordinary life. I don't want to get by by doing something that I kind of like whenever I could be achieving so much by doing something that I love and I haven't grown this love yet of being a model because I've never done it in my life I've never done any kind of modeling I've been in sports my entire life but I feel that this since this is a dream of mine I will develop a love for it and a passion for it if I just get this opportunity to compete for it. Um, a little about myself, I am the youngest of three kids in my family, three children in my family. I um, have two wonderful parents who love and adore us. I was born in my home in a town of 75 people in Northwest Arkansas. I went to school in a town of 2,000 people and it's just a cliche small town girl story where I want something big. I want to be a part of something bigger and better. Um, as I mentioned before, I participate in sports my whole life. I did track, volleyball, basketball. I was always involved in every school function. I wanted to always be around everyone. I'm a very social person. Um, I've also had many obstacles thrown my way. For example, in high school, my senior year, my parents told me that if I did not get an athletic scholarship, I would not be able to get an education. They would not be able to fund money for me to go to school. Briefly after them telling me that, um, I broke my back in while playing sports. And the break was 
I mean, I was able to continue. I had the choice of continuing to play or give up, and I kept playing. I fought through. I got what I wanted in my life. Um, I have a drive. I'm coachable. I can be molded into anything that you want me to be. I can do this. I want this so bad. Stormy, don't I want this? She wants it so bad. I won't shut up about it. It's getting old. <laughs> I, I know what it's like to be around and under a roof of a bunch of girls. I've traveled from tournament to practice to games with a bunch of girls. I know what it's like to just tolerate and be tolerated. I can live under a roof with other contestants. I can give it all that I've got and that's all that I can do. And this is me trying to convince whoever is out there, whoever is watching this, that I should be in this competition. I should have the opportunity and given the opportunity, I will make the absolute most of it because I want this so bad. I want to be the best. I've been watching this show since I was little. I, I want it. I adore it. I dream about it. I think about it all the time. And I just want the opportunity to show that I can do it. And I hope that whoever is watching this will see that I have a passion for it. And that's it.